Hello and welcome back to another video of mine. First off, I want to apologise for not uploading recently. I've been ill on two separate occasions and I've also been bombarded with work over the past few months, so that's been fun for me. Let's get on with this video, shall we? In this video, I'll be showing you how to download and install the Project Brutality mod for the original Doom games. You do need a Doom WAD file for this, so you can get those WAD files from either the internet, presumably, or you can most definitely get them from purchasing the games illegally. In the description of this video, there will be five links. You want to click on those links because we'll be using them throughout the video. The first link will take you to this GitHub page. This is where you'll download the Doom Project Brutality mod itself. So just click on clone or download here and click download zip. I'm not going to download anything because I already have all of these files. So just bear that in mind. Next link is GZ Doom, which is the source port we'll be using. So you want to go to this left hand column here and just pick whichever operating system applies for you. Just click on it and it'll ask you to download. Next is ZDL. Whoops. ZDL. This is the launcher we'll be using, a very handy tool, so I'll download that. And the last two are optional, but I'm going to show them in this video anyway, because they're cool. One is a Ultimate Doom Visor Hood mod, so just download now. And the other is Maps of Chaos, which basically expands the original maps and adds more enemies. So just download those two if you wish. Minimize that once you have those downloaded. Next, you want to go into any directory and you want to create a folder or two folders to store Doom ZDL and all of the mod files themselves. You can put everything into one folder if you wish. However, I like to separate ZDL from the mod files just for organization purposes, really, just to stop everything from getting cluttered. But I'm pretty sure you can put everything into one folder if you wish. So open the folder that's going to contain the mod files. Now you want to open another file explorer and you want to navigate to wherever you saved your mods to. First off, we are going to do the Project Brutality files themselves. So just copy and paste the zip file you downloaded from GitHub, like so. And you want to rename the .zip to say .pk3. Now, from what, from what I understand, a .pk3 file is pretty much a zip file, but with a few subtle differences. I'm not too sure what those differences are, but they're not major, which is why we can rename it and not experience any data loss. If you don't see the file extension, i.e. the .pk3 bit or the .zip bit, you want to click on this little arrow here. And you want to click on view, and then you want to make sure you've got file name extensions ticked like I have. Next, let's do GZ Doom, which is the source port. So just highlight everything like that, like so, and just drag and drop. It could not be simpler, god damn it. Next, we'll do Maps of Chaos. You've got the normal version, the hardcore version, or the overkill version. The overkill version is the hardest, followed by the the um, hard, hardcore version. If I could speak, that would be nice. And followed by Maps of Chaos, the normal version. I'm going to use the normal version because I'm a noob. Uh, next, we'll do the Ultimate Doom Revisor mod. Just pick whichever ones you want. So obviously, you want the base one. Alt 1. Um, mugshot, screen effects, ambience. I'd highly, 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 to the power of 2, recommend that you pick one of these fonts because without the fonts some of the text becomes unreadable i'll have preferred the a font but you can experiment with that and pick whichever one you prefer drag and drop it could not be simpler holy hell lastly we'll do zdl so i'm just going to go back here and just open the folder that's going to store the zdl files i'm going to open the zip file and again highlight everything and drag and drop excellent we can close that off now we don't need it Right, you want to run ZDL and you'll get this wonderful, visually stimulating menu. It's, it's, it's beautiful. It's so undeniably raw. It's so good. I mean, you're not mistaken here. It's brilliant. I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway, external files. This is where all of your mod files will appear. Source port. This is where all of your source ports will appear. We, all, we are only installing one for this video. iWads. This is where all of your wads will appear. Let's set this up, shall we? So you want to click on the settings tab, uh, source port slash engines. You want to click add. I'm going to add GZ Doom. Obviously, that's the one we downloaded. So navigate to wherever you've got your GZ Doom EXE. iWads. I'm going to add the Doom one, the Doom WAD. Sorry. I'm going to navigate to Steam C Maps Common Doom Three BFG Edition Base. Wad Doom. I'm also going to add the Doom 2 Wad as well. Excellent. Next, let's do our mod files. So just click Add here. We'll go to wherever we saved our mod files to. 
if I could learn the alphabet, that would be great. Uh, we can click more than one if you want to. So Maps of Chaos, Project Brutality itself. We'll take the base. Oh, most of that, 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 that. Nice and simple. Holy hell, it's too easy. And that's pretty much it. You can add more mods if you want to by just clicking this add button and navigating to wherever you've, you've saved them to. And we can just click on a wad here and make sure our source bot selected and we can launch. Now, I'm not going to be able to play this very effectively because the key bindings are messed up. I think they're designed for aliens with six arms, but I'm a human with two arms, so it's going to be much more difficult for me. But I'm just going to play it as a demo. New game, Project Brutality. Yes, yes, yes. I am actually using the uh, arrow keys to look around, by the way, that's how bad it is. The great communicator. Can't even reload. I've got oh I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I can't even Oh no no no. Anyway, as you can see, everything works fine. Thank you for watching. And I can't look up I can't Oh ah Anyway. Thank you for watching and goodbye.